What's up everybody and welcome back to another Forgotten Farm Friday where I go over farms from past expansions that you may have forgotten about. Today we are going over one of the books that you need to unlock one of the appearances for the Paladin weapon in Legion. So one of these ones you get from Dire Mall actually. It is this one right here, a thoroughly read copy of Nat Paggle's Guide to Extreme Anglin. Quite a mouthful. But as you can see, it has a 12.8k region market value and a 0.04 sell rate. So we, I like to go to Dire Mall North, which is this northernmost one, of course, right here. So without further ado, let's hop into the dungeon. I feel like this one here is the best one to get these books. So we are going to go over the spawn locations in this dungeon in particular. So I run this on my Speed Druid. The only reason I kill these is just to get myself a little boost as we run through the dungeon. Otherwise, I'm not really concerned about the loot as much as I'm concerned about getting the books, since we are talking about those in particular. But you can't help it. Sometimes you just gotta kill some stuff. So let's hop over this way. We, I do not see one up right here, but there is, oh, it is right here, guys. Perfect, perfect. So this right here, this is our book. Now, because we got one here, there will not be any more spawn throughout the rest of the instance, but we will still go over it. So this right here, this is one location right here. On our map, you see we are in this bottom corner right here. And let's continue. At this point, we will just kill so we can pick up our, we have our bear tatar on. So I will just keep breezing through this instance. So our next one is a bit of a long walk. That's why I kind of recommend you go, if you have your speed druid, if you have a speed set on a druid, come on him. Try to just sprint through the dungeon if this is what you're going after. So of course, if you see a chest, you gotta go find the chest as well, but I do not see it up. Oh, there's generally one. If there is a chest, it is in this corner over here. So right here is where the next book location is. You can find it in this area here. So of course, since we already got one, we will not find one here. Now let's hop up this way. And there is one final location it is at the very last boss and I will point out where it is at as well. But this is always when I started running to get the books. I did try the other ones, but I definitely preferred this one. I love running Dire Mall East for the transmog itself, but I seem like I, I never find any of the books there. Of all of the times I've run Dire Mall East, I've, I've only found the books maybe two or three times. Whereas when I used to run this pretty consistently to get the books back in Legion when they were crazy, crazy expensive, um, I, I found it almost every other run here, if not every run. All right, so final location is right here, right in front of Co Rush the Observer. And that's it, guys. I mean, super, super simple. Get a couple of these. Come maybe in the morning before you go to work. Breeze through these. Use your dream walk right here, pour in and out of the dungeon because Blizzard just changed it. It's, it's very, very quick. It took, what, two minutes maybe to get to the end of the dungeon. So I highly recommend come here, get a ton of these books, post them on the auction house, post one, two, don't, don't destroy the price. The price is currently destroyed on Proudmoor. You see that we are at, I think 150 gold when I opened it at the start of the video, but please don't, don't destroy your price. Keep it high so you can make your profit off of it. But anyway, guys, that's it. That's the video. If you liked this and you would like to see more content like this, consider subscribing and hitting that bell button for alerts on all new content. And if you would not, if you don't want to wait, then I am also on Twitch. I am under the same name, Seathrift. I will add a link in the description below. I run loot appraiser challenges five days a week and I give away pets every weekend. So I hope to see you there, guys. Thanks again.